Hi, I'm Rob Simmons, Product Manager with Garrett Advancing Motion. The topic I'm going to present is turbo system optimization. While turbocharger selection is a critical part of your project, selecting the correct mating components is equally as important. Optimizing the entire system ensures that the engine will make the target horsepower and everything functions properly. What I hope you take away from this is not only a better understanding of turbo system components, but also where you can find this information for future use and projects. The areas that I'm going to cover are based on questions that we've received during trade shows and races, as well as areas I feel are commonly overlooked. So let's get started. For charge tubing, the tube diameter should be sized with the capability to flow approximately 200 to 300 feet per second. It is common to use Mach 0.3, which is 325 feet per second, as a guideline because for speeds of that amount, the changes of density are very low, around 1%. Selecting a flow diameter less than the calculated value results in pressure drop due to the restricted flow area. If the diameter is instead increased above the calculated value, the cooling flow expands to fill the larger diameter, which slows transient response. Using the 526 cubic feet per minute for our 400 horsepower application, a 2.5 inch diameter tube results in a velocity of 257 feet per second. This is within our target range, so it will work for our application, and luckily it's a common size for aluminum tubing. For general design guidelines, Bends in the tubing should be at least 1.5 times greater than the tubing diameter. The flow area should be free of restrictive elements, such as sharp transitions or large area or shape changes. These best practices optimize system performance, but at some point the available space in the vehicle usually dictates certain designs. This concludes the video presentation. I hope you found this information helpful. As I mentioned at the beginning of the presentation, this information is available on the Garrett Motion website along with other general and technical information. Thank you for your time and good luck with your future turbo projects.